yo, from the hottest to the coldest, from Mississippi to the soda, from D.C., all the way around the world, man. A Mississippi naga telling it to you how it is, all right? You know, I've been around the way, and one thing I can say is that the naga is special. He has a certain level of intelligence and understanding that surpasses a lot. I haven't seen none come close to the reasoning of a, of a Naga. And you can see the whole biblical stories when you travel around the world. You can see the different peoples, you know, and how they understand and how they see things. And being a Naga and me being a Naga from Mississippi, man, I see it. You can see all kind of niggas, man, from there. So you, you got every kind. But for uh, for them to, to see it, I'm looking at it from their perspective. They do look at the Naga as a royal gene. They hold this down. It's like a part of the necromancy where they they held it in. So my Naga, Mississippi, you know, I need to listen up because this, this involves us and y'all also. I got to say, we included. You know what I'm saying? But this is your brother out here. Your uncle out here just reporting the information back. Because, you know, we don't like to leave. Where we, where we don't like to leave Mississippi, man, because it's beautiful. And we get a bad flat on what Mississippi is. You, they always say, oh, man, it's racist down there. It's da -da 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 -da. They don't realize that the most hospitable, the most lovingest, the most kindest of humans that we can call human beings on earth is in Jackson, Mississippi, or just in Mississippi alone. Very supportive. If you ever had a concert, my knockers, if y'all, if you famous or whatever, and you did music, and you ever came to Mississippi, man, and you a brother or a sister or something like that, you know, um, and you performed, I guarantee you got love, man. I guarantee you felt like you was in Little Africa or whatever the fuck. You know what I'm saying? But it's not Little Africa. It's our home. It's our cradle. The Delta. All that's together. Louisiana. Alabama, Georgia, Florida, you know what I'm saying? The islands, all of that is up in there, man. You know, so they didn't want you to know because they make it seem like you they done talk, they done brought you from another place and tracked you over. But there was a trail of tears that happened, you know, where they these people, you know, our people, we we pretty much followed the Bible genetically and naturally. It's like embedded in our soul and shit. You know what I mean? Because we like we don't want to kill another, but we like that's why we always say, "Well, bust your head open," da, da, da. and we be just be bucking like hoping that we don't have to. But if we do, we do. You know what I mean? And it's like really peaceful people. I have to say it like that because Mississippi people get a lot of flack, yo, and they don't understand if like if people came and visited like from around the world that they would be welcomed so much that they would not we would never have felt this type of love ever in their life. No matter how many festivals they probably went to, you'd be like, damn, you can actually feel a down home meal, down home chill, you know what I'm saying? Especially with the old folks, because there's older people in Jackson. Real old, like, you know, they all on the porch too. When they come outside, they get that sun, man, you know what I mean? So, and at the same time, you know, the flack comes from all of the, the, the slavery shit which is them basically false information because niggas already been there living in, the, in in Mississippi, man, the Choctaw. They already living, been living in Mississippi, man. I mean, been there. Mississippi. Already been there. Going up to Minnesota, Detroit, you know, Chicago. All them buildings was already built. We just didn't, we don't remember. We was a vast civilization. It's Atlantis and all of that shit, man, you know. I mean, those buildings are stone buildings. Chicago, those buildings are immaculate stone structures the spirit controls the round the, the spirit is what influences certain people if they're lower on their vibration due to their dietary um, habits or just just naturally just being low and they're just a vessel for you know demonic entities and shit to help persuade them and do evil ass shit which will be allowed by the most high because the most high wants your ass smart so he gonna let you go through some shit do some hell do some shit you know, but that's in order for you to come out right. So to understand the most high, you have to 
to look at the wisdom, the manifestation of the knowledge of the Most High that we see that's made manifest. You can manifest wisdom just by, you know, your wisdom, but it's coming from the inspiration of the Most High. It's just giving you, it's like a little version of what the Most High does all over the damn place at the same time. And the spirit, your spirit could be the same way too, but the Most High is just the, the overall version of it. Like, I mean, everything. And even if thou had a million dollars, brother, and still not feel happier than me. No. <laughs> That's crazy, right? But the thing is, is about the joy. You know what I mean? The million dollars come once you're able to handle the discipline. It's, you know, lower entities, they give you a million dollars. They know you can't handle this shit. You know, you just squat that shit off because you'll feel shame and bad later and shit of what you could have, should have, would have because your mind ain't even finished developing. The mind can trick your ass. You ain't take time to sit back alone and isolate yourself and see what's up. Listen to nature. Listen to the breeze. You can listen to the breeze, yeah. Listen to the trees. Blow through the breeze and shit. And the breeze hit the trees, hit the leaves, make a song and all of that. With the waves and the ocean and shit. You know, all this stuff go down. This is nature. The only thing that's not a part of nature is the mother who's just like looking at nature in, in amazement. Like, what the fuck? I'm talking about looking at the humans part of it too. Like, damn, who is that nigga? You know? Not an amazement like, yo, the Most High Hawaii created another type of motherfucker. Not a grafted person who are created from, or grafted things. Because they can't, or who was created from uh, the creator's creation, you know what I'm saying, basically. So, who are made from that. So, you know, they don't really have that long time. That type of shit don't have that long of a time. I'm Mississippi Naga putting we up, putting you back up on game as you can, cause y'all smart as fuck, we smart as hell, and just took one to get out the side and boom, 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 and get the information back. Like, oh, hey yo, we gotta eat a lot of fruit. We was doing that. You know, that's what kept us swole in a motherfucker. Yeah, we was eating beans and rice, and yeah, that we still, still gotta do that. Um, but we gotta cut back on the meat. Gotta cut 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 the swine out. You know what I'm saying? We parent be like, oh shit, I didn't mean to do that. God damn, because you know you didn't. You know what I'm saying? Once you get back here, you know you don't want to sit back and kill another animal and squeal to death and then eat that motherfucker. Do you? Do you? God damn. If you do, well, we got a place for you. That's how it's going to be. Everybody going to have their fucking place. You ain't going to just be coming around sneaking in the place of the, of the righteous and just like smoothing through like, mm -hmm, you don't know that I'm over here low vibratorial and shit. But no, we're going to all sense that shit, man. So we're raising the vibration up right now, starting to miss it, been hitting all over around the world. You know what I'm saying? So don't let nobody... Kill your vibe or take your vibe down, your joy, because that's what they've been trying to do. But they can't do it because it's it's from the most high, man. It's from the most high, the most high light. We just babies on earth. As we rise up in different plateaus, like boom, 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 boom. You know what I mean? And that's just due to like the spirit realm. Hey, look at the homie right here. You like, hey. What's that name, my dude? Wheels here and then in. <laughs> you a little antsy today, man. You a little ready to jump on things. I tried to give you some food earlier. You was just acting a certain way. No, that's it. You didn't give me no food, that's it. I'm out here, son. I like how this tastes right here. This tastes very nice and lovely and scrumptious as I lick it. Oh. Oh. No. <laughs> Let me pull it back, man, because you getting you actually enjoying that shit. Let me pull it back. <laughs> he is enjoying that motherfucker. But yeah, man, um, that's how a wall communicates with each other. And that's why he's a part of nature and shit. A wall does shit like that. You know what I'm saying? Just hey, don't mind me. No, no, no. This is it's part of nature. He don't do dumb shit. I mean, if it is, it's, it's cut short, quick. Alright? But yeah. That's how it is, y'all. Get back in nature individually, heal. Get athletic, you know what I'm saying? Eat your fruits, berries, and your melons. You may, Man, don't feel bad. You better eat that goddamn going watermelon, man. Especially before a workout, because you'll get swole like that again. Like, <laughs> nah, you get swole in the motherfucker. I'm telling you, you got citrulline in it. So it's the BCAs, branch chain amino acids. You ain't got to take all the other shit. I'm telling y'all, man. I'm telling you. So get on up. Hey, uh... Get your workout on. Keep training. I see you at the peak. Leave a comment, whatever, at the bottom. If you're from Mississippi, you know what I'm saying? Show some love. I love y'all.